Welcome back everyone. This is Ruben Chato at Chato.com. I'm just showing you the plaster stages of the Nawood sculpture. Now you want to put plenty of plaster on here because you're going to have to shape it. Uh, don't minimize. You know, you're, you don't want to have these wire mesh areas still showing so you want to be able to cover all of it. This is going to be the eagle feather that I'm putting on here. As you can see the waves starting to take shape. And I still have like one or two more coats of plaster to apply on the actual sculpture. But as you can see, it's coming to life. And the thing that I want to ex express to you students out there is when you're using your pail where you mix your plaster in, always keep water in it or the plaster will harden in there. And then you have to find another pail which is going to slow your project down. And keep it clean as the plaster starts to harden in there, wash it out and don't ever dump it down the drain it is plaster so dump it outside in a container or something for disposal so as you can see I still have some more areas to cover here and you will have little cracks just keep keep it wet and keep it smooth you know you can reapply plaster over plaster as long as you keep it wet uh, don't apply plaster over dry plaster that's not gonna work out for you it'll crack and fall off anyway so this is chato.com and this is like stage six that I'm showing you here and I can't wait to show you how to do the patina on it as well so anyway this is Ruben Chato your favorite Apache sculptor and for more just go to chato.com thanks again for tuning in to my Chato channel here on YouTube alright have a great day